Okay, so moving on to the 2023 release, uh, what we've uh, done here is we've actually started to begin the UI UX enhancements. And so this really allows us to have a common look and feel across the Aviva portfolio. And with respect to that, you'll notice that we've changed some uh, user interface coloring designs. Uh, the button styling has kind of uh, taken its own shape. And then we've uh, also leveraged the empty states uh, configuration so that as we don't have any content that may exist, uh, we'll prompt you for a wizard that will actually take you through that configuration. So it does try to make it a lot more intuitive that you, when you pick up the, the product and, you, and you're actually just consuming and using it. And then again, that also does align around our uh, portfolio as far as let's see if this uh, will play. And uh, it, it does align around the rest of the portfolio here as far as the functionality uh, delivered. I'll just maybe uh, show my screen here in a moment uh, and give you that full experience. But we also introduced OPC UA server tag writing capability uh, in this uh, framework. So the OPC UA server, again, is, has full control capabilities as well as the industrial graphics framework. And again, that's mainly because we enabled that feature set across the platform common services uh, functionality. And the way we actually delivered that was uh, through a new set of security that we put into the framework. Uh, so you'll see that uh, as we design and build this uh, uh, write support out, you'll see that we actually have created a tag level security uh, framework for us. So uh, in this example here, we're seeing that we've created a user named Bill uh, and he be belongs to this process engineer's role. Uh, within that role, we now have provided that on the uh, data that we're sharing out. So our variable tag now has an associated security uh, tied to it. So this allows us to control that framework from the industrial graphics as shown here or as well as the OPC UA server side uh, for data sharing. So we're gonna continue to take that move towards tag level based security uh, that we'll continue to build upon uh, going forward in the product. 